tough question. Um, thank you for that. I, you know, I struggle with vision because I have all of these things sort of coming at me and I just see so much opportunity out there, you know, unlike what you hear on, t on television and in the media that we're sort of kind of heading, heading down and the world's collapsing. I think there's so much opportunity out there. Now I do think there are some, some economical challenges that we're going through. So, you know, one of the things that, that, that is a priority for me over the next 12 months is making sure that we're in a position, our, our balance sheet and our financials are in a position to take advantage of what's coming because it's coming. Yes. Um, I'm, I, I'm not going to take credit for it, you know, but it's, it's out there and there is, I'm talking out of sort of both sides, but it, the world's not falling apart, but there are some, some financial challenges that are coming when interest rates went from 3% to 8% in a couple months. I, there's going to be some things happen. So, you know, kind of one, number one for me is just making sure that we're in a good financial position to take it, to take advantage of what opportunities may present themselves. Um, yeah. Number two, um, sort of builds on number one. Again, it's a little cheesy, but making sure that we have the right people in place to take advantage of said opportunities when they come. Um, and number three, maybe just, again, doing the little things right. Um, you know, one of the things that I, I picked up from, from listening to, to podcasts like yours and Vistage and whatever is just, you know, writing a little anniversary card to all of our employees. Um, it, it takes, it takes not a lot of time. It takes some time out of my day, but it's important. And it's just the little things that people, uh, people appreciate. Um, we, we have a, a sort of a, a sales competition inside our organization for hitting, you know, making certain phone calls and emails and those sorts of things. And one of the things that I implemented was writing handwritten cards to customers and potential customers, because no one does that. And going back to what I said earlier, it's the little things that matter. And if you're going to write a card, so you're going to take the time out of your day to sit down and focus on writing a little thank you to, to, to someone you just met with. Hey, I really appreciate, you know, your time. I, I really enjoyed listening to X, Y, and Z. I'd love to learn more. It's that simple. Again, it's just the little things. And there's a million little things that you need to do right, but... Uh, and maybe that should have been the first thing I said instead of the last thing. It should have been number one instead of number three. But uh, it just, again, it's just doing the little things right. 